Do you understand some of the Spanish comments? And team and trap. Yes, I do understand some of the Spanish comments. Motherfucker, it's called Google Translate. You feel I like a rope? Hey, y'all be roasting me, but I love it though. What's good, YouTube man? It's your boy Lamont. Did it, man? Y'all already know what it is. I'm back today with another video. Another. Uh, here we go. Uh. Bang, bang, banger, baby. Today is not a reaction. Today is gonna be a Q and A, man. Hey, uh -huh. So I posted something on my um what you call it, like your story or whatever or your post whatever on YouTube and I said I wanted to do a QA, send me some questions. So a few of y'all hit me up with some questions that you know I'm gonna go ahead and answer. Now, before we get into the video, this is a little different than what I'm used to. I'm used to doing reactions. I'm not really I'm always doing sit down videos because reactions are sit down videos. But I want to do something different, take my channel another direct another direction with some of my videos, man. So let's go ahead and get into the video, baby. Alright, so for those of y'all who don't know, I'm Lamont. I'm from North Carolina. Uh I live in Carnesville, North Carolina. Basically like Winston Salem, North Carolina. That's hard to say. I'm from Winston Salem. Uh I lived in Arizona before, I lived in Virginia before, like, I've been everywhere, you feel me? I lived in the hood, lived in the fucking middle class neighborhoods and suburbs, if you want to call it that shit, whatever the case may be. I done been everywhere, done done everything, and seen the love, seen the motherfucking lot, you feel me? But, let's go ahead and see, the first question I'm going to get to is... What is your favorite song of Argentina by Tobias? I think it's like I said, Cracker, Tobias, okay? Alright, so my favorite Argentina song is. Hmm. I don't know, since I've been getting into it, I would say. Damn, bro. It would have to be that, uh, that. I think I'm. I don't know if I'm ever saying his name right, but it's Ducky. It's Ducky, right? Dookie Ducky, I don't know how you say this shit for real, but it gotta be that rock star. That shit go hard, man. I don't know, that shit just bump. I play it in my car and that shit hit. You feel me? I be having a whole fucking block hitting, you feel me? Uh I just answered this one, but from Javier Pastor. Where you from? I'm from Winston Salem, North Carolina. That's where I'm from. Born and raised in North Carolina, but I done lived in some other places. But North Carolina is my home. You feel me? Uh yeah, North Carolina is the home, man. Grew up most of my life here, so that's where I'm at. You know what I'm saying? Who is your favorite Migos member by Tetrix Malone? My favorite Migos member is uh, Takeoff. I feel like Takeoff got more bars than all the rest. I don't know. Takeoff is underrated. He quiet. He don't really do interviews. But that moment would like spit, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Takeoff is my favorite. But I do like Quavo and Offset too. They be spitting too. Do you hear Quavo and Offset more than you hear Takeoff? Which is why people go with them, go, lean towards them more. I guess Takeoff is more like the laid back and stay to himself one out of the group. You don't really see him in media and shit like that. And if I'm moving my hands a lot, that's just me when I talk, I express myself. But, uh, yeah, Takeoff for me. I don't know. I like Takeoff. I feel like he can spit. He underrated out of the group and everybody always exclude him from shit since he wasn't on bad and bougie but fuck it it is what it is he can spit though who is your favorite artist from south america I answer that. do you speak spanish a little bit i can get hola como esta bien y tu motherfucking that's about as far as you gonna get from me god it man i'm trying man i be studying and shit i took spanish all through high school I just ain't gonna lie, bro. I suck at this shit. I'm, I'm explaining to you. I really, 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 I really, 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 really only took Spanish because of the girls in high school. We had some fine ass Hispanic women in my high school. I promise you. I promise you. And I took Spanish to be in there with them. You feel me? 
And I kept them laughing. Y'all know me. I'm a funny ass dude. I'm a goofball. I was probably annoying too, but shit. I kept them laughing and I passed Spanish. I don't know how, but I passed because I didn't do shit. I promise you, I didn't do no work. I was just a goofball. Everybody liked me. I was a funny dude. Uh, class clown joked around. That was me. I played football in high school. Um, shit like that. So, you know, I wrestled a little bit. I was just a funny dude, bro. Like, when it came to jokes, you couldn't touch me. If it was in the spirit of the moment. Like, I can't think of jokes. Like, shit for me just rubs off my tongue. So, if we was in like a, a fucking... I couldn't do stand-up comedy. Like, that's not me. I can't plan my jokes. Like, my jokes come from me being in like a situation where niggas is roasting me. And I just gotta say some shit. Or I'm in class and I'm just like feeling myself. Or when I'm drunk. When I'm drunk, I be off that shit. Off that off the shit, you feel me? So, I mean, it is what it is. I'm the funny dude. I speak a little bit of Spanish, like basic shit. Other than that, I be Google translating like a motherfucker. Oh, I got some Hispanic friends who can goddamn hook me up. My boy Martin and shit like that. Uh, the dude who cut my hair, my boy AJ, the fadeologist. If you ain't follow him on his damn Instagram, check out his work. Like we told y'all when he cut my dreads, and y'all tripping. But my boy AJ be translating some of the comments for me. Uh, I just got a few people around that I'm, I'm cool with and I speak to on a regular basis that help me out, you feel me? Question from, I don't know how to say this shit, bro, but Chris, Christian, what do you do when you are not recording reactions? Bro, I work, you feel me? Like, I work a regular-ass job. People keep thinking, like, I just do YouTube all day because I get a couple thousand views every now and then, but my YouTube really just started popping. I'm not making any money from it, so... I'm just a regular ass nigga, bro. I work, like, I work, bro. I fucking work. I work a job, like, I work 10 hour shifts, four days a week. I pull my 40. Besides that, though, like, well, I really work 11 hour shifts, cause I am a, okay, if y'all wanna know, for my job, I am a team lead. It's like a supervisor. I run the shift. I'm over a group of people, like, I don't want to say I'm a boss. I don't like really bossing people around. I just kind of like, I lead them in the right direction. You feel me? Like, I don't like bossing people around. But if they force me to do that shit, I do it. Like, I take my job serious, man. You know what I'm saying? That's my way of income. That's the way I get to pay for everything I got in this apartment. I live by myself. Just me and my beautiful ass dog. Y'all seen it one? Ah, shit, motherfucker. I'm getting beat up by my goddamn computer desk. But yeah, this is that's the way I pay for everything I got in my crib. That's the way I bought this fucking eight hundred dollar camera. That's the way I bought this fucking thousand dollar laptop. Fucking thousand dollar phone. It's the way I bought everything. This fucking thousand dollar TV I got sitting right there that I barely even watch. You know what I'm saying? I just spend my I, I spend money on stupid shit. I, I ain't gonna lie. I'm about to give me some food right after this shit. But I don't know, man. I work. That's what I do when I'm not recording reactions. I work like crazy, man. Like, I gotta pull in this money to pay these bills. Like I said, YouTube not paying the bills. I don't even get money from YouTube. I'm monetized, but since, you know what I'm saying, I ain't really getting a lot of views. Of course, I had a few videos hit big, but I'm not getting a lot of views. Shit going crazy for me right now. For the moment, I'm getting stable amount of views on certain videos, depending on what I'm reacting to or what y'all tell me to react to. I get a few thousand views on it which is cool but I'm not really making no money actually I'm not making any money off YouTube even though I'm monetized but I mean it's all good like it's gonna come sooner or later right now I'm just trying to build up a fan base uh, uh, a strong fan base to the point where I can start selling merch and and doing freaking ads and and fucking doing promos for companies and shit like that like that's what I want to do that's it's gonna get that though man no some YouTubers get success overnight, but that's not me, bro. I've been grinding on this shit for a year, bro. Just about a year. On and off a year because I get, you know, in those spells where I don't want to do shit. Like, right now, I'm not even going to fucking stunt. I've been so tired. Like, I don't even want to record. But it's like when I turn on the camera, I get excited because this is what I love to do. So that's what I do when I'm not recording. I work like crazy. Oh, and I do take college courses. So, I take college courses and fuck, that shit is fucking annoying, bro. It takes so much time, so much energy, 
it just drains me. That's why I said in my, I just posted the post. Well, y'all gonna get this video tomorrow, so I just posted a post yesterday, which I'm mean, well today, which y'all gonna see is gonna be yesterday. That videos will be every other day because I gotta focus on school. So I mean, I gotta have to dedicate some of my time towards school. And think about it, guys. I mean, I gotta work, go to school. Which both of those are full time things. I go to school full time. College courses are full time. I mean, this is shit. And then I do work full time, forty eight plus. 50, if you run beyonds, I work 50 hours a week. Uh, college courses take a lot of good time. And then I post videos a lot. So videos will be every other day now. And even though I'm doing reactions, bro, like y'all see, I put effort into my reaction videos. I edit them bitches and shit like that. I just try to make it interesting for y'all to watch. Cause y'all watching me when y'all can be watching somebody else or fucking out playing outside or going to work, whatever the hell y'all do every day. I don't know y'all. So y'all got shit going on in y'all lives too. Y'all be with family, but y'all take the time out to react to to watch my reaction. So I gotta make it interesting. Uh, so by that being said, send some dope ass songs. I only like reacting to dope ass songs, uh, unless it's some lyricism shit too that y'all know I can react to. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna be like breaking that shit down like for real, for real. But um, yeah, that's what I do when I'm not recording reactions though. Work, school. I mean, I got family, shit like that too. I got little brothers and sisters, family I go visit. You know what I'm saying? Cause I don't live close to really any of my family. I live relatively close, but the closest family members I got is like 30 minutes away. And after that, everybody is like an hour <laughs> or more. So it is what it is. Uh, the next question for Frank, Frank's Keto is, uh, what the fuck is it? All right, fuck my phone right now. Next question is, who are you? Me, I'm a goofball, uh, family dude. Um, I mean, I don't really know what to say. Like, I'm a goofball, bro, I'm a loving person. I like to have fun, even though I'm boring as hell. People call me like old head because when I don't want to do shit, bro, I sit in the crib. But a lot of times when I'm not doing anything and I'm sitting in the crib, I record a video. So, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm a good ball. I just want to be... And what do I want to be, man? I just want to be successful, bro. Like, whatever the hell I do. Like, if I got to work while I'm doing YouTube for the rest of my life, fuck it. I'm going to fucking work and do YouTube. And hopefully, YouTube brings in a couple hundred dollars a month, you know. So, your boy can goddamn buy shit and... Do stuff for the fans, like do giveaways and shit like that and fucking I don't know man, but I'm a loving person bro, I'm a goofball, I like to have fun, I talk a lot of shit dude. Like if you ever play sports and you got that one guy in your league that you play against you hate playing against because he talked too much shit, that's me. He ain't lying. You ask anybody I went through high school with, I talk shit when I play football. Every I could have been out. You could have called me the sorriest person on the fucking team. I would not care. I'm going to talk shit while you burn me, motherfucker. Like, I talk too much shit. Uh, and that's just me, but I talk shit, like, jokingly, man. Like, I don't always mean, I don't really mean that shit. Unless I don't like you. But I don't have any enemies right now. There's nobody that I don't like. I'm cool with everybody. Like, I'm just a person who you can trust. Like, shit like that, man. I got a few friends that I've had for a long time. Other than that, I don't really mess with a lot of people, though. Cause I mean, I just don't feel like I can trust a lot of people. But y'all, y'all my fans. I fucks with y'all, man. Y'all my day ones. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Hey. Yeah. Anyways, that's who I am, though, man. Who am I? I'm a goofball, hard worker. I like to have fun. Chill with my family. I got my little brothers and shit. I do a lot for them. I love them. I might not talk to them every day, but my little brothers know, like, fuck it. I love them. It is what it is. Kill for him. And who I am though. Do you like the trap in Spanish? Is a question by Smoothie. Do I like trap in Spanish? Hell yeah. Reason being is it's so it sounds so much more interesting. Hearing trap music in English is fucking half the time annoying. Because you can't understand them anyway. And if you do, you just like what the fuck is it? saying or talking about they just make up words and say you hear it in Spanish is much more interesting 
just being honest much more interesting um shit sticks out more to you so when they say something you want to google the words who the fuck it man um i don't know it's just more interesting to me feel me let me check my minutes real quick where i'm at and 14 fuck that's a long ass video but shit is interesting in spanish man like and then me trying to learn Spanish and like listening to it and shit like that, it helps me kind of learn what the fuck going on and shit like that. But, um, yeah, I like trap music in Spanish. It's more interesting. I'm just saying, like, and then, like, if you honestly think about it, like, in Spanish, in the Spanish culture, people get along more than in the black community. Black community, everybody beefing, everybody want to kill everybody. But in the Spanish culture, man, I don't know. This is how I see it, though. But y'all, y'all music dope as hell. I'm not gonna lie. My love to Argentina, for Mexico, Puerto Rico, all that shit, man. I got homies. Like my homie Taz is like big on this fucking Spanish music. Like he put me on to a dude named Fuego. My boy Taz is like big on that shit, man. He ain't my boy KC, so I mean they be putting me on to a lot of shit. This is originally where I started. I reacted to my first video because. I was just looking up Spanish music to listen to, and then I found some shit. I, I forgot who it was, and that shit right now is at like 71,000 views, so I appreciate that. Um, but, yeah, and what's my, so what's your favorite Spanish trap song and favorite artist? Right now, y'all see me re reacting to a lot of Ducky, ECI, um, Neo Pastilla. Them motherfuckers go hard, bro, like you can't deny that shit like they go hard bro and uh that's who i like uh my favorite song was rockstar i said that shit in the beginning of the video but that was by mexican tamale that question next question is by tu tucha salada saldano my bad what the fuck i say salada like i'm speaking of a salad or something nigga <laughs> Want some croutons in your salad? You like some brunch? You like some brunch? Uh, what do you do for a living? I said that uh, I work at a warehouse. I'm a team lead. I don't like calling myself a boss, but I'm like a supervisor. I just manage a group of people, make sure they're doing what they supposed to be doing, and I make sure they get paid. Uh, what are your favorite songs? I like Rockstar. I like, uh, I just did a reaction the other day. What was the name of that song? Toto de Oro. It means all go in Spanish, in English. But, uh, what else did I like? Man, it's a few songs, but. What are your favorite songs? What do you think of Argentina Trapper style? That shit go hard. I don't know. I just like it. Fun, crazy shit, though. This is what I'm going to say, too. I like it because that shit be fast. It's like they be rapping, and it's like the flow of that shit be fast, and they go hard, and they just ride. It's like crazy. But it's like Spanish people can talk fast as shit in Spanish. But people who speak English can't talk fast. You feel me? Like, we might mumble our words up, and y'all be like, what the fuck did y'all just say? But it's like, we can't talk fast the way y'all talk. We can't talk fast in English the way y'all talk fast in Spanish. And that just makes y'all music way more interesting, for real. Uh, somebody asked, does it bother you that trap, that trap Argentinian rappers wear braids and stuff? No, it don't bother me at all, bro. Black people set the culture for a lot of shit. Y'all see goddamn white people be jacking the style all the time, you feel me? And I don't really think they jacking the style, it's just that they love the way black people do shit blacks or hispanics because hispanics are trendsetter too like but if you honestly think say about it in this world colored people you know, i'm talking blacks hispanics and shit like that asians we set trends for a lot of shit like white people just hop on our trends honestly like we set the trends for a lot of shit and white people just follow behind and because the white culture the white people kind of like bite off our culture our cultures they so-called make it famous when they hit these big white magazines and white media and shit like that. But really, black people, Hispanics, and Asians already been doing that shit for years. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, what's the next? Cause are you in a relationship? No! No, 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 no. But I'm looking, though. I'm single. You feel me, baby? Because I'm a sex man. 
yeah, I'm looking for a relationship. I'm not, I'm not in a relationship. I'm looking for one. I wouldn't really say I'm looking. I'm just trying to fit a vibe with somebody. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah, really. That's it. Like I'm, I'm chilling. If it don't come, it don't come right now. Fuck it. Like I got a whole life ahead of me. But you know what I'm saying? It would be cool to have a lovely lady here with me and my beautiful ass dog. My dog needs a mom. You know what I'm saying? Uh, when is your birthday? My birthday is October 4th. I'm a Libra. Libra gang in the building. Y'all already know what it is. And uh, this last question, well, it wasn't a question they said. I don't know, bro. Cheers from Argentina. But uh, appreciate all the love, man. I did have one more that, one more question come through. Let me get that mug. Yeah. Came through actually while I was filming this. So I'm going to go ahead and get that hole. So, the question is from, damn, low, my lover. Q went next, the question, I don't even know what the motherfucker shit say. Do you understand some of the Spanish comments, and also, what do you think of Argentinian trap? Yes, I do understand some of the Spanish comments, motherfucker, it's called Google Translate, you feel me? God damn, y'all be talking shit. Somebody even said I look like an ant. Somebody said I look like a roach. Hey, y'all be roasting me, but I love it, though. I, I don't care what y'all say about me in the comments. I like to see what y'all want me to react to, so y'all do that. And I just be trying to pick whatever got the most likes and react to that. But, hell yeah, I understand some of the shit y'all say in the comments. Like I said, I got friends who can translate for me. And they be doing that shit. And they be, I be laughing like a motherfucker. We all be laughing like, damn, y'all be talking mean shit. And, uh, I don't know, man. That's the end of the video, though, man. Woo, we at 21 minutes. It's your boy Lamont. Dead, man. It's the end of the video. I appreciate y'all for, uh, you know what I'm saying, tuning in, being a subscriber. Uh, I will be doing a giveaway soon once I reach, let's say, I don't even know what I want to reach to be able to do my giveaway, man. But I'll be doing a giveaway soon. I might just pop up spontaneously and do a giveaway. I don't know what it's going to be yet. But y'all, man, you know what I'm saying? Appreciate it. Always keep it 100, like the hat say. You feel me? Keep it 100. Yeah, everything go good for you in life, man. I'm a happy person. I've been on, like, this positivity vibe for a while, man. So, hopefully this YouTube, YouTube shit pop off for me. Uh, if it don't I mean it is what it is life, I know it's gonna pop anyway, so I don't know why I'm saying that shit like I'm on the rise, I'm grinding. I love doing this shit, it makes me happy. It makes y'all happy. Obviously if it didn't, y'all wouldn't tune in. So if everybody who tunes in, you know what I'm saying, if you watch this far, comment down that you you watch this far and uh you get a shout out and possibly and shit, I don't know what I'm gonna do for my giveaway, man. So I can't really say that right now, but you're going to be a true OG. And uh, it's your boy Lamont did it. Back with another banger. Another react. Oh, not another reaction. Blah, 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 blah. Not cutting that out. But anyways, it's your boy Lamont did it. And I'm out. Peace. Huh?